Ooh. Am I gonna die? No. <sighs> Let's go try out our new gun. The Arasaka Shingen Prototype 5? Where are these people? 6th Street. Oh, oh. Contagion's supposed to spread, right? Is it spreading to anybody? I'd start running if I were well, people know I'm here now. What other stuff spreads? Maybe not too much. Oh! The gun has some flaming bullets too. Yeah, the one bad thing about the smart guns is that I think you have to have line of sight. Despite how the bullets are auto-aiming, you still have to have line of sight. Like, I can't just curve around the corner here. Can it? No, I can't. The little diamonds indicate how... how well tracked the enemy is, I guess. It's okay. I mean, it, right now it seems okay, but I'm not sure why it's such a legendary gun just yet, maybe. Hmm. It has an Arasaka logo on the side. <laughs> Aren't people gonna realize I stole it once they see, hey, how come that person has an Arasaka gun? It's got half a logo. <laughs> Assault skill shard, thank you. Kevin Lowen and Crox Alvarado. Take some chums and go down to the construction on San Mamaro. Rough up the workers when you get there. Scare them. Nobody's allowed to work on whatever they're building. I gotta say it's coming from you? Nah, fuck them. Messages for Willis, not them. Willis? That developer? Yeah. I thought he was in with Melotech. Yeah, he was. Now he ain't. Mm. Developer as in building developer? Like a property developer? Yeah, it does kind of seem like there's some kind of construction work going on here. By scaring the workers, did you mean kill the workers? Because whoever you were telling to do that clearly was killing all the workers. Which is messed up too, because like... You're trying to send a message to the developer, but you end up killing these people who are just working here. Oops. Hmm. Have a drink. It's been a long day. The developer, very likely, is just gonna hire new guys. It's not really gonna um, change things. But it's kind of like how the Nomads didn't like Biotechnica going to the Badlands. to try to like, you know, go on their territory and whatever. Judy says, knock knock, what up? How are things? Eh, you know how it is. Why? Something the matter? Had a great time in spite of the circumstances, all thanks to you. Maybe we could do it again, just without spilling any blood. Anytime. Can't wait. Anyway, still waiting for Michael to spill the deeds on our meat. Call you when I know more. Yeah. I want to go home, okay? I need to check on the cat food. I think the next major one I might do will be the Panam one though, because I need an excuse to go back to the Ripper dock to get the mono wire and stuff. I've had the blades for a long time now. And I haven't been using it lately too. <laughs> Maybe we'll do one job, two jobs before going back home? Where are we now? We are in Rancho Coronado. Yeah, this area here? Quite a few jobs. Are we making any progress at all on, like... Just looking at this map, I never feel like I'm making any progress. <laughs> I feel like we are. We should be. It's just that it's... Oh, look. Look who's looking for me again. I'll get back to you when I have time. Yet another crazy marker here. <laughs> Why do you want me to go all the way there? My god. Because of the construction work. Probably the cars don't go anywhere near the construction. Okay. About this gun? Oh. Wow, I've never seen this plot of land here before. It's completely just being developed. Hey, we should check it out then. This seems like the kind of place where they would hide something interesting, right? If we're only looking at quests, then it's really easy for us to ignore the... Um, 
more secluded spots too. I'll have a casual look around, although it's kind of getting us further away. I want to go higher up. Speaking of construction, I'm pretty sure uh, there was a place with a ferris wheel and we went by it one time. I think someone mentioned that if I ever come across it again, I should definitely check it out properly. Don't remember which district that's in though, although I kind of feel like we must be sort of close. It's right there. Okay, great. Why don't we head over then? Perfect. I mean, that's a... What did I hit? That ferris wheel is lit up. But it's obviously not being used as a ferris wheel because it's not even in the right orientation. So what's going on here? Did it fall down and then people are like, okay, well, we'll just make it a decoration now or what? Something like that? Oh, Arasaka. Better hide my gun. Just in case. I'm not, I'm not holding your gun. I'm... I'm a regular law-abiding citizen. That's all. You know, I don't typically see strong-arming as the best way to get results. Still, sometimes you're left with no choice but force. There's this scuzz bag needs to be... reined in. A sadist on a corporate leash. A real hemorrhoid on Night City's ass. Do us all a favor and handle this contract. Details are attached. Rogue. We're looking for Vic Vega in Rancho Coronado. At first I thought it was just rumors, but then you hear the same thing again and again and again. Then you start taking an interest. Now it's confirmed. Time to dive into action. Look, I don't want to sound naggy, but back in my day, workers knew how to stand up for themselves. Instead of fixers, they had unions to fight for their rights. I know, I know. Unions are not a thing anymore! Oh my god! Now that unions are gone, workers can't afford to hire fixers on starvation level salaries. Luckily for them, I like to do some pro bono work from time to time. You know, a little something for the public good. Oh, how very kind of you, Rogue. Especially because you didn't strike me as a charity type. On the fine deets, Vincent Vega, the kind of scum who writes cracking skulls in the hobby section of his CV. Well, that's exactly what he's doing in Rancho Coronado, cracking skulls. Not only that, but he's got the full backing of the corp execs, who'd rather give their workers brain damage instead of a 2% raise. 2% raise, let me remind you, doesn't even cover inflation, so that's not even a raise. Vega and his people have been terrorizing the whole neighborhood. Kill him. Maybe then, the corporals will realize they crossed the line. I wonder what the economy is like, actually, like... What is the inflation rate these days? Do people even store money in banks anymore? No, we're talking about Bitcoin again. You know what happened the last time I did that? Accidentally killed two people on the streets. Well, I see a window here. I'm not inside the building yet. I don't... Yeah, there's no place for us to stand, though. I mean... You can have a look around. Is this related? We could. I feel like that's something, but you can't climb in the window. Oh, but this one you can. This one you can. Oh, what the heck? I thought that was a climbable thing. Really? Oh, you don't need it. I don't need it. What? Hey! Am I allowed in? This is public. You'll have the rest in a second. I'm sorry, do you have an appointment? I... I do, in fact. 
I do. I'm here to get rid of some unwanted documents. Beg pardon? Which documents? How am I supposed to know? Job said come here, so here I am. Yes. Nobody told me anything about any documents. Hmm. Looks like you've got a real mess in here. Little odd it would be in order, don't you think? Okay, wait. One moment. Let me check in the back. What? This guy definitely sensed something was wrong. <laughs> he felt that I took- Oh, maybe I should be looking at the computer. Is she gonna come back? Oh, no, 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 we can't go past the line. Shh. That guy's a problem. Oh, but I could've jumped over the counter, though. No one knows anything about any document removal. It must be a mistake. Guess someone in HQ had a short circ. Thanks anyway. Nice place. There any office space to rent? I'm afraid that won't be possible. All our spaces are currently in use. Oh, by whom? I'm sorry, but I can't reveal that information. Looking for Vic. Vic Vega. Never heard of him. You must have the wrong address. Get the impression I'm asking too many questions here. Okay, I have the card, but I don't think we can walk in, because she's looking. And I don't think we can walk in here either. We'll check in maybe later. Well, do you mind if I borrow your washroom? Is that alright? Thank you. All right, we're in. Ew, that's disgusting. How do I look these days? You know, once we find the armadillo mod... Oh, you know, I look actually pretty close to a truck driver. You know, like earlier during the Arasaka thing? Hmm. Well, probably we gotta go find more armadillo mod stuff. And then we'll think more about fashion and whatever. I never really- oh, frick, man. Gosh dang it. We had a technical 12 door in the back. We got the key card, but it doesn't mean it's uh, it's useless if we don't use it here. It'll be useful in other places, probably. I just don't want to go through the front door, you know? But this definitely seems open. There's no glass there, but it won't let me- Really? Okay, I have a plan. I have a plan. What's my biggest car? The Mai Mai might be the tallest, actually. I have a plan. Do you know what it is? Can you guess what it is? Hey, where's my konnichiwa? It's nighttime now though, but yeah. <laughs> Wait, there's a guy standing- Was there a guy sitting right there? Uh, okay. Clearly this works, but, um... I'm gonna save. <laughs> I thought I saw somebody's shoulder. But, uh, I gotta do it again. Th there was definitely someone sitting right there. Okay, so it works, but I'm not gonna do that. But, you know, just so you know, it does work. But there's a guy there, so I'm scared. I should probably... You know what? I'm gonna go in and ping that guy. This is a small job, but I'm spending like 20 hours sussing the place out. Is he sleeping? He's reading something. 
Dang it. If you weren't sitting there, I woulda. But also kind of surprising that you didn't see me. Aha! Freak ton of people. Uh. Mm. We're in. Uh oh. What are you talking about? There are no terrorists here. Well, I guess that goes <laughs> all of that for nothing. All of that for nothing. You know what? That's fine. We did a lot of stealthing earlier, so we should go kill some gonks now. Yeah. Oh, there's no BD. Jeez. Wait, seven... Seven, eight. Oh, look at everybody in the building. Dude, weren't you looking over there? What? Uh, that's not gonna work in time. Ah! <laughs> they already know. They know. Actually, do they know? Oh, their eyes are. It's like the reboot optic spread. Shh, everybody. Shh. Need a medic. Nobody needs a medic. They're all. Whoa, that's a bit extreme. Nobody needs a medic. What were you in charge of here? Weapon room? Stay in your hidey hole for all I care. I will stay in my hidey hole. Thank you very much. Security! Vic Vega to C-Team. Starting from today, the doors of the building will only take the crypto keys I handed out last week. The ones I stole off the right, desk. Keep looking. So better not fucking call me saying you can't get in. If you see anyone fumbling with the locks, pin the asshole to the ground floor and raise the alarm. Already sounds like an asshole. I found him? New tenant! C team. C team is Vic Vega's team. They need security and privacy. So don't disturb them. Second floor where- Oh my freaking god. How much do you want to bet that guy I saw in the window was right, Vic Vega? How much you want to bet? Bonuses. We collected ourselves a nice little pile, which means bonus time. 20% determined by rank, 30% by successful interventions, and 50% through participation in Black Ops. Black Ops. His entire team is... Mm, yeah, I guess his entire team was probably not fully in the workers. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna try. All right, keep looking. Is that Vic? Is that Vic? If it, it is, it is him. Look, it is. Okay. Oh, should I make him suicide right here? Do it. Maybe we could have talked to him. Stay in your hidey hole for all I care. Wow, beautiful. Vegas flatlined and no one else is, so I'll <laughs> chalk that up as a win. Community suffered enough as it is. Get closed. I'm not so sure about the not- Whoa, 9,000 eddies, holy crap. Not so sure about that part, about how nobody else died, but okay. The one thing I'm thinking about is maybe if I had gone in peacefully, then he would have offered me a different deal, is I'm guessing what potentially could have happened, but you know what? We weren't gonna take this guy's deal anyway. All right, keep looking. Okay, what? Did they not mean for me to come in here? Cause... Is there a window here or not? Cause I don't... There is a window. No wonder. It doesn't look like there's a window though, right? Like, maybe it's the lighting. They have tinted windows on the other end. I want to collect my earnings. 
from Big Vega. Oh, finally, Chase. Yeah, he's These like won't accomplish anything. Pretending to be some tough military guy. Just go away. Don't go in your boss's office. Yeah, so I couldn't have gone in here stealthily anyway because that was a window. And the whole time I thought he opened the window, but he didn't. It's tinted windows. Kendachi. Excuse me, I can't read. Excuse me? Are you serious? You're being really annoying now, lady. What Rogue doesn't know doesn't hurt her. Ah, it's the chemical damage again. That's what I'm talking about! Okay, if you're all gonna be like that, I'm gonna hack the rest of your place and get all of your money. But I'm really surprised with how generous Rogue was. That was a lot of freaking money. Priya Raj, got a job for you. It's about Priya Raj. She runs a garage up in Rancho. This is the fourth week she stalled on payment. Someone needs to teach her her place. And that place should be a hospital. Burn the garage. It also seems Milicio didn't learn from his mistakes. So let's teach him another lesson. Feel like we've seen that name somewhere, but I can't pinpoint where. Help to Wendy Chu. Hey, we took out one of the guys. He was making trouble. Make sure NCPD doesn't stick their snouts in this. Okay, so... Bad cop, Wendy Chu. I'll remember your name. Protection, Jamil to Vic. Mutual friend mentioned that you guys know how to deal with workers. <sighs> yeah, he's asking him, hey, how do I... How do I mess up my workers? Protection payments. Priya, stalling four weeks. Okay, who is making grunting sounds? Stop. Everybody in this team was complicit in all the crazy stuff, right? So, okay, whatever. I don't mind killing them. I think you can look for new tenants soon, receptionist lady. We have two smart weapons now, kind of don't like that. Was there anything else around here? They actually had a pretty damn big office though, look at this. There's like 20,000 people here. BD, 1C, 1C, 55. Oh no. E9, BD, 1C. I think it's because the divided we stand is a chemical weapon. So some people are probably. I think? I think they're having some pretty bad stomach aches, is what's happening. Dude, they had a huge office. It's not Arasaka, but it's pretty respectable too. And how did they get this? Service is offered. Property protection and intelligence gathering. Union infiltration prevention. Company vehicle inspection. Workforce surveillance. Strike breaking. Protest suppression. Yeah. By... Skimping out on workers' rights and all that. Taking all of your money. Who is the one moaning? Seriously, I'll just put an end to you. You sound like you're in a lot of pain. Five. For once, getting the access point stuff doesn't seem like it's worth more than the job. The job was like 9,000 eddies. Not again! Not again! Alright, I think I'm out of here. Unless if you wanna... Okay, give me a sec. Oh my god, you won't guess what just happened. I accidentally 
disassembled a iconic weapon. So I went back a little bit, I reloaded to make sure that I could get it back. Yikes though, it's so easy to do that. I wish you had have like um, I wish you could put a lock on the weapons that you want to keep for sure. And then just clear out the rest or something. There's too much random inventory stuff sometimes. I just wanna... I just wanna shoot some gonks, that's all. The whole time, somebody's still been moaning somewhere down here. Was it that guy? Sounded like it. Oh, that's almost perfect. I, uh, I want to pick it up, but I feel like this is going to increase my inventory weight again. Are you all finally happy? Seems like it. We cleaned house. Oh! Oh, man. Your worker? Not the workers that are being exploited, right? Because you guys are with Big Vega, is my understanding. Mm, 1C. Nine. Great, so we ended up going through the entire building anyway. Why not? Not a bad thing. Oh, the cafeteria! Or the pantry. There's just some takeout food here, pretty much. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Thanks. Don't really need your permission anymore, but okay. And, uh, receptionist lady! You're gone! Where'd you go? I still wanna talk to you. No, it's the same stuff. Eh. Alright. Yes! I remember you! E9... Oh, it doesn't even start with E9. Mm-hmm. Ooh, $2,000. Not bad. We're gonna buy all the cars with all this money. But yet, the only car I'm still gonna drive is the Mai Mai, probably. <laughs> I love that car so much. Where's the BD? Um, I don't see... Hold on. Whatever, we'll go for the easy one today. Hmm? FF? Oh, that's it. Unfortunately. Oh well. It looks like sometimes they don't even give money. It just gives components? Or maybe it takes a while. Oh. Okay. Farewell, building. Farewell. We probably did a good thing today. Probably. And we can head for another one right here. Assault and then... Another Quadra Type 66. Another one? Why are there so many of these? Probably let's do... Uh... Yeah, let's, let's do these two and then maybe we'll fast travel back home. How does that sound? Sounds good to me. Around here? Yeah, Cor Rancho Coronado was a one neighborhood that looked pretty... Like, North American-y. Is that a good thing though? I don't know, because some of these places are pretty garbage. Six Street Gang again again. Oh. Everybody else got sick. That's great. The Contagion is really great for little clumps then, huh? Definitely noted. Are we all cool? So the six free cars, they don't really have that super gaudy flashy stuff going on. But not bad, not bad. Smiley Hard Pilot Cap. Arcadius Loaf and Spencer Young. Ben stealing parts. Who? You know, Ben, our mechanic. You got proof? Could be serious. 
Do you? Hang on, let me write. Anyway, it all started the other day, when my ride suddenly stopped in the middle of the street. Of course, I called for help. After a while, the guy comes by and he says to me, Get to the fucking point, loaf. Hang on. And he says, Well, he asks, actually, if I'd been putting shit replacement parts in the car, and there I am, like, what replacement parts, right? Chum, stop. Just stop. What? What do you mean? I mean, I get it. Just can't fucking slog through another one of your novels. Ben swapping up parts in our car for cheaper ones, then selling the more expensive ones on the side. Exactly! So let's go get him. How soon can you get there? Be there in 30-40 minutes stops. Okay, see you. <laughs> Some people just want to add more details to their stories. You know, they, they want to they wanna make it more vivid. So, did y'all get Ben? I don't even know. I just came in here like a wrecking ball. This could have been Ben. No, I probably... Some people we have names for, some people we don't. I don't know, man. Ben could have been here. Arcadia's Loaf could have been here. Anybody could have been here. There's also a clothing shop here. I don't care about buying clothing, but it might be worth checking for armadillo mods. Hey, I completely forgot about going to the Ferris wheel. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? I'm not done with that, okay? I'm gonna go back for it, but let me do this one first. Oh no, am I gonna know how to get back there? Or maybe I should go stand somewhere really, really high up. Oh, frick. The person asking for mercy died. Don't think I killed them, though. It was the guy... It was the other guy. You fast. These smart guns are nice in that you don't have to aim. But it's nice to aim for headshots, too. It's fun. Or even just use blades. Oh, jeez. Yeah, and also, I need to find a drop point or something so we can go do some selling soon. <gasps> what is this car? Did I do this? Was it like this already? Uh-oh. How come I'm getting the impression I made something glitch out? Sent to 4,800 users. Vote for Jefferson Perales! Do you care about workers' rights? This message is for you. My name is Ivan Vasilev and I'm one of you, a proud blue-collar worker. We work together, we drink together, we've said goodbye to our friends together. We slave away together on safe conditions. No healthcare, no insurance, no retirement fund to speak of, but we got our families, don't we? Families who suffer when they lose the sole breadwinner. Who will help your loved ones when you're next? Not Arasaka, not Militech, not any megacorp, but the union will. And right now, the union needs your help. Your vote. Do you want to make a difference? Vote for Perales. The candidate for real working citizens. Keep the mayor's seat out of Weldon Holtz's corporate clutches. But looking at it like that, Jefferson on paper. Jefferson does seem like the better candidate. I have a feeling this is what we were supposed to open. Oh, reloading put it back here. But the car's gone. Deleted and Julia Bennett. Listen, I have an assignment for you. Union man Ivan needs to disappear. You need to take care of him. Him and his trade union could cost us thousands of votes. We're already neck and neck with Perales as it is. He's a problem. People above you okay this? Okay what? I've got no idea what you're talking about. Alright, chill. I'll take care of Ivan. How's that? Classic, the old junior reporter move. Think he'll fall for it? He's careful, plays it close. For a young female reporter who wants to hear all about his thoughts and opinions, hang off his every word? Yeah, I think so. So would you. Okay, okay. One more thing. Ivan's people love him. I'd rather they didn't. Okay, we'll toss him the usual boosters and XPDs. Got some real bad ones. I have no idea what you're talking about. Holtz's his people? Damn, man. Ivan must be one of these people then. He was the president of the people... Advocating for Perales, I guess. Oh! 
Perfect. We'll head over right here. And the clothing shop is here. Yes? What's going on? Nova, like your style. Thanks. God knows I try. Hang on, did you just smile? What? Me? <laughs> no. The Night City? You must be seeing things. I missed it! A smile- I'm actually gonna see that again. Nova, like your style. Thanks. God knows I try. Hang on, did you just smile? <laughs> what? Me? <laughs> no. The Night- A little bit. Need to change up my style. I dare say we have something for everyone. Do we have an armadillo mod? We have a stylish turquoise sports glasses for $3,000. Panacea. Immunity to poison and shock. Holy frick, what is that price? I mean, that's pretty good, but do I, I don't think it's worth that much money. Super insulator. Grants immunity to shock. So it's both. Oh, well, hmm, would it be worth that much money? I mean, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. But it would be so good, we'd never get poisoned or shocked again. How often does that happen, though? Here's another one. Resist. Oh, but that... The amount of money is stunning, though. And it's only a one-time use thing. If you gave me the crafting recipe for that much, I'll think about it, but maybe not one-time use. Damn, though, huh? That's crazy. Okay, gonna sell some stuff. I cleaned the lady out. Oh, this makes me so angry. Look, this is 150, but she has 149. I don't think I've ever really looked at the screen seriously, but look at this. I have so many quick hacks. Whenever I choose which ones I can add on to my cyber deck, they only show me one of each variant, but look. Cripple movement, cripple movement, cripple movement, cripple movement. That's how it's actually working in the background. As far as I can tell, if it's the same rarity level, then the stats are all the same. Which is probably why we're only seeing one variant, but jeez, man! There's my synapse burnout. Cool, but I can't sell any of it. <laughs> it doesn't cost any, uh, or uh, I mean, it doesn't have any weight anyway. Well, thank you, lady. Zero, zero, apparently. Let's... Head to the Ferris what? wheel. You're just gonna leave. Yeah. The parade will soon start. I will wait where we met before. By the stalls. Just stay out of trouble, okay? <laughs> the parade can wait. Parade's not gonna start at one in the morning. It's fine. You swish my thingy. Yeah, actually, I don't know what job I want to do, so I guess I'll just leave it at that for now. More importantly, I'm very curious about this Ferris wheel here. Just cops looking at nothing in the middle of the night. Alright. Satan's pits. <laughs> just walking around here. I'm a regular citizen. <gasps> That's a nice car. It's the Portugal car again. What happened? Nothing, just a car exploding. That's all. We're in the 6th Street Gang neighborhood. All right. Yeah, apparently nothing. And technically, nothing's happening here either, but I just want to check out what's happening. Why are there so many lights? Did they turn this place into like a market? Or... Oh, uh, I don't think it's a market here. It's more like a homeless camp. Good Yakitori Night City! Tempura Night City Cheap, Udon Night City, Tasty Ramen. Is there anything to eat in this wasteland? Oh, I was wondering why he was talking like that. 
Goro, you can't find anything because you're sending your searches to me as messages. I apologize. It is this cursed interface. Or a virus. I've got a few ideas if you're feeling peckish. If you want sushi... Oh, I wouldn't trust V's opinion on sushi. <laughs> Can't go wrong with Tom's Diner. They have the best pancakes. Oh. I have not had the opportunity to try it, but I suspect I would not be welcome there. Why? What did you do? Did you do something at Tom's Diner? I hope not. Oh, look at her backpack. That's kind of cute. But it's open. It's open, lady. Yeah, maybe there's not an actual quest going on here, or is there? Try layer air mid weave fixer skirt with jacket. Damn. Velvet O-ring choker. Money. Kendrick Feller and Octavius Brown. Yo, your boys paid me a little visit down on the block. High out of their goddamn minds. Set some wheels on fire, fucked up Reggie's shop, and sped off. Anyway, putting together a crew to pay a return visit when you feel me. But then I decided I'd give you one more chance. You give me the chooms who went buck wild down here, and I'll forget it ever happened. Whoa, whoa, just a sec, I feel ya, eye for an eye. But you're trying to pull up the entire optics. Boys are just having a little fun, ain't nobody get zeroed. And you're asking for their heads on a plate. Fucking chill, Choom. Let's meet, we'll talk, strain things out. No point in spilling any blood, right? Fine, we'll talk. Yeah, we will. Yeah, we'll talk. Oh, is that just the grasses sticking out, or... I was wondering how they killed this person. This is probably Octavius Brown. Well, that was probably the gun that did it. Oh, jeez, man. Were they talking at the Ferris wheel? Oh! Oh, hey, oh, there's another thing! Another legendary thing, what? Well, how do I get in? I don't wanna... Mm, I'm gonna scare people if I try to break inside. I know it's glass, but is there like a... Nice way for me to go in? Both of them died? Wait, everybody died! Did they die because this thing fell down, or how did that work? We have to find out. We will find out by... Uh, I like... I like these guns. I'll take this one away for now. Look at this baseball bat. 12,000 damage. Damn. I'm sorry guys, don't get alarmed, okay? I'm just... What? Am I not supposed to be able to do this? But that person has something! Something! Damn, what the hell did they make this ferris wheel out of? Or maybe I gotta shoot a gun. Cyber psychosis! <laughs> I'm really sorry, everybody. What the frick? They have bulletproof glass here? Maybe it's like a main mission thing. Okay, well, I'll keep tabs on this place, maybe. Oh, it's the little black area next to Kendall Park. Okay, fine, fine. Well, I was planning on just looking around the area, but now that I scared everybody off, oh, that might not be happening. Oh, look at the dolphins. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, just chill out. I don't mean to... I'm not interrupting. Not at all. If we were really good at parkouring, I imagine we can walk up this thing. Is it worth it, though? There might be something at the very top. I'm guessing we have to come back here to figure out how this thing works. Like, I, as far as I can see, it doesn't have any vulnerabilities. Okay, Octavius Brown and Kendall. I'll come back for you all. 